Yo, editors! Again, it's me, Tanvir. Welcome to part three of the Beginner to Advanced series. There's an effect act that most editors overlook. Not because it's weak, but because they never understood its real power. This isn't just a tutorial. This is the turning point where your edits start to move with purpose. Today, we master Oscillate, the unsung hero of motion. So what even is Oscillate? In simple words, it's an effect that creates smooth, repeated movements, like waves. You can make your layer vibrate, swing, bounce, even breathe, but only if you use it right. Where to find it? Step one, open a light motion, select your clip or shape layer. Step two, go to effects. Step three, search oscillate. You'll see options like magnitude, frequency, and angle. Let's break them down. Magnitude controls how far it moves. Frequency is how fast it moves. Angle defines the direction of motion, zero degree for horizontal, 90 degrees for vertical. Example, for clean vertical bounce, set angle to 90 degrees, magnitude 20, frequency 3.5. See that? Smooth and reactive. Common mistake that most editors do. Avoid this. Don't go too high with magnitude and frequency. You can, but only when you're making an energetic edit, but make it like it's understandable, or it looks messy. And don't forget to blur and motion blur for realism. This was just one effect, but if you truly understand how it works, you're no longer just an editor, you're crafting motion. Subscribe for part four, and drop Oscillate Mastered in the comments if you made it here. I'll teach you how to make smooth shake in part four, so make sure to subscribe. See you in the next video.